well, first of all, we thought we'd come for one year. And so it sounded like a good adventure, and I have always liked campus, campuses, and I thought it sounded very attractive. Mm -hmm. I had worked for a newspaper, and I wasn't planning to work. I thought I'll just, you know, absorb Iowa City. And Sandy had not taught before. He had practiced law. Mm -hmm. It was a big shock when we made the decision to come here. You mean our families and our... No, both of us, because I proposed on a Friday night and got a call from the law dean the next day about coming down and we were not at all sure that we wanted to move and so forth and so on. And so we came down for a year. I think our family thought we were out of our mind. Why? I mean, we were. she was a writer and editor for the Minneapolis Tribune and I was in a good law firm and why would we depart? To a, uh, you know, to a new job. Mm -hmm. But she was very good about it. And then a year later, people would say, because we had picked up funny things from the paper, for instance, I have a clipping I just came upon the other day. A woman was uh, recovering in Mercy Hospital. She'd been kicked by a cow. And I thought, oh, that's local interest. <laughs> And so my friend, our friend said, well, what other funny things do you have to say? And a year later we were saying, well, there's nothing funny about Iowa. It's where we want to live.